a warm welcome here at Dortmund Ewing. Today we are standing in front of one of our most modern railway service center and we will discuss today the digital supported maintenance processes and to do so I've invited one expert, he's at my side, welcome Dennis. Hi Andreas, I'm happy to welcome you here in our fully digitalized maintenance depot in Dortmund. Dennis, what's the difference between uh, maintenance processes in former days and nowadays? In the past, the maintainer went through the train with a checklist and checking every single component. Uh, also, we had the information from the train driver in the past saying, an example, the door is damaged. Nowadays, we get all the information by the train itself. Today, we are pretty well prepared when the train comes into the depot. Absolutely yes, but that's not all. We had also the automatic vehicle inspection in our depot, which means when the train comes in the depot, the train drives through the automatic vehicle inspection and we get all the measurements and all inspections on the boogie components. Dennis, here we are at the automatic vehicle inspection unit. Can you explain me how it works? Yes, sure. Here we see an example, the automatic measurement system for the wheel profile. On that point, we see an example, the automatic measurement system for the brake disc and brake pads. This is automatically done when the train passes by. And wh where do we use that data? We are sitting here in the planner office in our RX depot in Dortmund. On the top left hand side, we see the train in operation. On the bottom left hand side, we see the prediction of the measurements and the information coming directly from the train. On the bottom right hand side you see the planning in our depot. So directly from the information from the prediction we say when an example a reprofiling is necessary or an exchange of a door drive is necessary from the information coming from the train. On the top right hand side you see the depot plan when the where the train is located inside our depot itself. So with the information coming from the train coming from the automatic vehicle inspection all together bringing up in Radiant, we have the opportunity to directly give the supply for the material in advance. And from that point on, we have also the just-in-time delivery into our depot. So when the train comes, the spare part is directly delivered to the track and exchanged on the track. And even if the, we find a vandalism damage, we are able to 3D print it directly in our depot and exchange the part so the availability of the train is as planned. Mm -hmm. Means we, we're doing predictive maintenance uh, and the, the heart of it is to be efficient, right? Yes, absolutely. So with all that features, we are absolutely efficient and can ensure the 100% availability for the trains. So also for the customer of our customers, we are able to bring up the train on the track as planned. So, and finally, we do have efficient maintenance processes here. In this case, the exchange of a DCU. Yes, absolutely. The maintainer works out the exchange now, but we got already the information of the train during the operation that the door control unit needs to be exchanged when the train stops the next time in our depot. The maintainer will exchange the part, also the system, our CMMS core map, and that information will get back to Radigent so that Radigent knows we have exchanged the part and the prediction was correct. Perfect. Thanks for these interesting insights. You're welcome. I'm happy to show you a little bit around in our fully digitalized depot here in Dortmund. Thanks, Dennis.